In the discourse surrounding Secretary of State Gina Griswold's remarks, a broader narrative emerges. One entrenched in the landscape of perceived threats and intimidation experienced by former President Donald Trump and dissenters of the MAGA movement. Secretary of State Jenna Griswold, it is always a pleasure to have you. But in this instance, I am sorry that we have to have this conversation. First of all, I have to ask, how are you and your family doing? Do you feel like your safety is paramount and the most important thing to have to maintain right now? Good morning or good afternoon, Katie, uh, depending on the time zone and happy Easter. And it is unfortunate to have this conversation, but I think it's necessary because the, the bigger picture is that anybody who stands up to Donald Trump or the MAGA right is barraged with threats. Uh, and a lot of us standing up just happen to be women. So those threats are not only violent, but sexist in nature. Uh, and make no mistake, this is part of the strategy. The MAGA strategy is to spread as much disinformation as possible, to pass those voter suppression laws, undermine faith in our elections, and try to scare election workers out of their positions. And we have seen the threats to election workers be somewhat successful. Here in Colorado alone, we had a 38% turnover of elected county clerks since 2020, in part because of the vitriol. Uh, so we cannot allow this strategy to go unchecked and unnoticed. And that's why I do think it's important to have these conversations. Griswold's voiced concerns intertwine with conservative ideologies that prior it is a safeguarding against what is construed as a left-leaning agenda, primarily dissected through a political lens. Her statements not only shed light on the adversities encountered by dissenting voices, particularly women, in the face of opposition from conservative or right-wing factions, but also emphasize the necessity for fortification and solidarity among dissenting individuals. Through Griswold's depiction of the threat as potentially politicized or exaggerated, a pertinent inquiry arises regarding the true nature of these occurrences and whether they are orchestrated components of the strategic playbook of the MAGA movement. This interpretation underscores the pervasive apprehensions within conservative circles regarding the targeting and intimidation of those diverging from right-wing ideologies 